so you're ready to get your flame altar to level five well to do that we're going to run the black cauldron quest also the alchemy station we're going to get both and we're going to go take the head of a monster plus there are a bunch of new things that you need to get in the flame altar and i'll cover those throughout the video so you want to stick around to the end to make sure you get all the information you need let's get to it Alrighty, folks first things first you can see that uh i've been working on working on getting the armor figured out the leather thing how to get that we'll have to get a bunch more of that uh stuff when it comes to doing the next flame upgrade but i figured we better start at this tower because it'll give us a great advantage point to hit this area over this way there's a tin mine this way uh that custom market is for obsidian <clears throat> But we're going to do this, and then we're going to go hit uh, Rattlebeak, which is where the Black Cauldron is. I made a mistake, didn't understand what I, uh, who I was fighting, and I accidentally did something. But we're going to do this first, and then we'll do the next part. But I wanted to get this bad boy out of the way. Ow. We start with four right to begin with. Huh? Huh. Okay. Oh, can't open that. Really? Okay. Alright, that one we can open. Oh! One more. How much you want to bet? Ooh, I almost flew off the tower. Ah! I'm going to say, is it like that end? Door still closed. Yes, it is. Not in there, right? That'd be my luck. That we'd have to shoot through something to get it. <clears throat> Really? Was that easy? Was that one? Hmm. Oh, nice. Uh, really? Booyah. Ooh, a feather. All right, see what's the next one. <clears throat> oh, 
Okay, so there's a, a one we need to find. Oh, there is. Alright, go that time. Whoa! Ah, it's been difficult. was over there. That's the only door that opened now. Yeah. Well, up we go. Are you kidding me? I don't even know where we're supposed to. Oh well, you only have once. Blink. Okay, okay, I see what we got here. You see me getting hit. Inevitably, I mean, there's nothing you can do. There's no way I can make it around that. I'm not going to spend all that time. I'll just take a few hits. Yeah, but where are we supposed to go? Okay, I can see, barely see that platform. And then now that door should... And we made it! Nomad Highlands laced with forgotten promises of adventure and riches. Its underbelly is a wasteland, a hunting ground for the condemned. Those below gaze up at the glistening dawn above, tracing the faraway gold streaks of morning light in their fingertips. Enough! It's always out of reach. Okay, where did it pop up? I've just been too busy. Okay, so next thing we need to do is go here to Rattle Beak, because that is where you're supposed to find the Black Cauldron. Supposed to, I say.
Right there, there's a little village down there with a bunch of guys we'll have to kill. We. I don't look like there's a chest up there. Come on. Now, if you need fossil, you can. The thing we just flew through, all of this is all stuff that you can get. Doink. go yeah this place is weird too Quick run through the structure, see if we can figure out where. Oop, there we go. I also want the experience. Hmm. Uh oh. What we have under here? A chest. Ah. Okay, uh, we came out of it. All right, all right. Oop, oop. What do I see over here? Just in case, you never know. Anytime you see anything orange, you definitely want to make sure you check it out. Like this. Oh, the northern caravan. Okay. Yeah, the um, farmer wants us to try and find her. That is some incredible stuff there. Very durable. What I'm not seeing is a chest. All right, anyways, back to these guys. Now, let's see. We can go to the second floor here. Ah, oh, shit! Those. Really, there's nothing even up here. No chest. You, Mr. House. Fucking rat. Jesus. Okay. Nothing in there. Ooh. Good spot for peppers. Um, <clears throat> there's a couple of really good spots around here to get stuff. But if you need indigo, oh, no else, really? Sage, because the indigo plants look the same. Let's see, a little light on the subject. Those just turn into the uh, regular fibers. Okay, well, we'll have to wait for the sun to come up because what it does is it sends you over here to the Cradle of Dusk. There is a boss that we get to fight over there. I'm going to show you guys how to beat him. All righty, folks. So that's where we just were. Right there is where we need to go. 
And then for this fight, I would suggest uh, using a wand. You're still going to take hits. Um, but, man, this thing has got such a reach with its uh, weapons that you kind of got to just deal. Let's see how we do against him. It's right in the center. There it is. Here we go. Wait till he dies before you approach him. Yeah, I tried to run up and use melee and he just smoked me. So there we go. I got two black cauldrons. We just need to get out of here and then uh, we'll go back to our base and see what else we need for the alchemy station. Uh, the Black Cauldron would be perfect fit for the Alchemy Station. This is an essential concoction, an alchemy base. Yep. Oh, I just need Copper Bar. Okay, awesome. I've been uh, busy. Trying to make stuff. Let's see. I should change this recipe to 10. On it. Uh, you got to do um, tin and copper to make uh, bronze, which is the next tier level. Oh, let's see. Go. Come on. Put this anywhere we want, looks like. Yeah, I'll just put it right there. Alright, what can we make with the alchemy station? What are our recipes? Oh, that's it, huh? Okay. Okay, so the next thing that we need, and something that we needed with leather, is gonna be the ammonia glands. Let's see how my Rubios is doing out here. I've been a gardening mofo. Well, I got a, some of them wet. How are my sprouts? Ooh, I got 18. Now, I'm sure this will drive a bunch of people nuts, but it doesn't really matter to me as long as I get what I need. That's flax for linen. We're, um, this is made in 
which you guys see me running on is farm soil. We went over that a long time ago. That's what it looks like fully grown. Okay. I should probably make some more because we don't have quite enough. So you see it takes water, rubios, and fossilized bone. And screw it. We'll just throw them all in there. <clears throat> And the other thing I did in between episodes, require, uh, put a well in. You get it through the carpenter. This is a big time saver having it here, because then I can run over there, still grab water, depending on how long I've had this thing going, if I'm not running errands, and go from All righty, folks. We are right here in the Umber sh Hollow. That is what we have to kill. And they are nasty. Whew. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to fight these guys head on. Um, they got a nasty poison to them. You do want to try and shoot the little red things, though. Finally, let them explode. Because again, this is like poison central. And there we go. We got six. I think they have seven total. You just got to keep running around. Uh, shoot one, get it to follow you, get yourself someplace high and kill it. Alrighty, it is time to raise... Our flame level to five. Hopefully that'll open up the iron mine next. But you can see what we need here. Got it all. All right, folks. So there we go. We got the alchemy station set up. Showed you how to get the black kettle and how to beat. The Phil monstrosity head. Well, that monster. So you can get yourself all hooked up with some good gear, get your flame going, and hopefully we'll be able to go and hit the iron mine here real soon. Tune in next time. Who knows where we'll go next? As always, keep your heads down, your warriors of doom up, and I'll see you again a real damn soon.